Hey there, hey, welcome. We are nearly at the end of the 12 steps of how to conquer discouragement. And tonight I'll be sharing the 11th step. And it's actually quite um, uh, reflective for myself. So let me just share what the 11th step is and we'll go into the, into, um, the explanation. So the 11th step is Remember the principle of the birth, death, and fulfillment of a vision. Now this comes in three steps. So firstly, God will give us a vision of how we can be effectively used by him. Now I'm going to be sharing these three and then relating it to how it relates in my life. The second step is God will then allow us to experience the death of a vision to build character in our lives. And the Thirdly, he will then fulfill his vision through us in a supernatural way. Well, you know what? When I learned about this, them to learn new experiences. So I thought, right, this is my vision. This is what I'm going to do. Then two years ago, I had the opportunity to go up and run my own business um, up on a remote island. Now, I thought, now this is really cool. I could use the business to help indigenous people change their lives. But you know what? I had to experience the death of that vision because what I wasn't prepared to do is I kept my back door open. I kept it open and then I, I actually left my vision in the hands of others. Yes, it was my vision and I had some wonderful team members there to help me, but I wasn't fully engaged in that. So yes, I experienced the death of that vision. But you know what it did for me? I had a choice. I had a choice whether it actually discouraged me to ever go there again and not face, I, you know, I just faced so much embarrassment, so much, you know, discouragement is just such a big word. Failure. But what it did actually do is it built my character. It built my character because when I went down into the bottom, when I just felt so embarrassed, so ashamed of the lives of the people that I affected by who had faith in me and my vision that it didn't come through, you know, I, that just, that just, it actually probably killed me a lot, a lot in my spirit to say that, hey, you know, could I really do this? But what that allowed God to do then was to come through and fulfill his vision through me in a supernatural way. Because what's eventuated is that when I had that failed vision, my character was able to be renewed by the fruit of his spirit, which is in Galatians chapter 5, 22 and 23, which is the foundation for Lighthouse Directions, which means for me, he is the light in my life now and all of my experiences have come through so now I can go through and make the transition from being the student in my personal development to now having faith that his gifts he has planted in me I can now move forward and help others to transform their lives into their destinies to believe so with his vision, I can now move forward and I am having the time of my life. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't be able to have the nerve to think that I could come on and do live videos if I wasn't strong in my faith, if I didn't, if I wasn't encouraged to share his word to all of you. So thank you very much for sharing these 11 steps so far and I look forward to sharing the 12 steps of how to conquer discouragement. He is there. There is a purpose for our events of discouragement. So just look toward him. It is for a reason. Until next time, may your wisdom guide you. All good things.